activating your glory season by light. I am a light. Now I decree, may your light begin to shine now. Every darkness covering your light, I prophesy to your life, you are going to arise and shine. I, I'm speaking to somebody's destiny. I say, you are going to arise and shine. I decree your light will shine forth. Every darkness covering your light, that darkness I give you away right now. Come on, say, I am a light. Shout to me, say, I am a light. You are going to shine forth in the name of Jesus Christ. Can I hear you shout a better amen? Isaiah 60. Arise, shine. The Bible does not say arise and shine. It says arise, shine. For your light has come. And the glory of the Lord is risen upon you. For behold, the darkness shall cover the earth. And deep darkness the people. But the Lord will arise over you. And your glory shall be seen upon you. The glory of the Lord shall be seen upon you. I said the glory of the Lord shall be seen upon you. The Gentiles shall come to your light. And kings to the brightness of your rising. And you set the time to 30 minutes. The sun shall no longer be your light by day. For the brightness shall the moon give light to you. But the Lord will be to you an everlasting light. And your God, your glory. Say better, amen. Thank you, Jesus. Your sun shall no longer go down. Nor shall your moon withdraw itself. For the Lord will be your everlasting light. Say, my God shall be my everlasting light. Can you shout it with that amen? And the days of your morning shall be ended. Everyone at the sound of my voice. Whatever is making you to cry. Today marks the end of that year. I say every satanic agenda against your life. Today the end begins right now. I prophesy to your life, you will arise and shine. You will arise and shine. You will arise and shine. You are rising, you are shining. I say you are rising, you are shining. You are breaking forth in the name of Jesus Christ. In Matthew 5, 14 to 16, every child of God is redeemed to shine. You are the light of the world. A city that is set on a hill that cannot be hidden. Nor do they light a candle and put it under a basket. But on the lampstand. But it gives light to all who are in the house. Mm. Let your light so shine before men. That they may see your good works. And glorify your heavenly father. I decree every satanic agenda covering your light. Today must that end. Today must the end of your covering. Your light is shining. In your family it will shine. In your business it will shine. In your career it will shine. In your life it will shine. In your family it will shine. In your job it will shine. In your finance it will shine. Hello with me. My light will shine. By the light of the scripture, the earth is governed by darkness. And then the people, the Bible says, it is deep darkness. So man is in need of light. Check every nation around the nations of the earth that is doing well economically. By natural power that is light, things are working. You go to a place where there is a natural light or normal light physical light you see that there is no darkness out there you see the faces of the people are shining you see there's joy you see there is atmosphere 
and then go to a place where there is no physical light. You see that the people are dull. They are unhappy. They are not excited. Things are not working. How much more the light that brightens the destinies of men. This light we are talking about is not the light that is given by the government. It's not the light that a man can generate by by dam or by electromagnetic or by, by normal light that gives our electrical light. This light is not the light of your car. It's not the light of your house. This light is the light from God. This light is not just a sunlight. This light is a light that comes from the power of God. He said, arise, shine, for your light has come. God is not promising you light. The light is now. Hi, can you say a better amen? amen? God is not saying that the light will come. He said, arise, shine, for the light has come. For the glory of the Lord has risen upon you. He said, gross darkness has covered the earth. Darkness has covered the earth. And then gross darkness the people. But the Lord shall be your glory. I am here to prophesy to somebody here. No matter the darkness on this Nigeria, on in Asaba, in Delta State, ravaging the earth, because you are here today, the light of God will shine upon your life. I said the light of God will shine upon your life. Every child of God is redeemed to be a light. We are saved as light. We are empowered as light. We are appointed to arise and shine as light. Then if you are appointed as light, the question that I should ask or the question we should ask ourselves, why are we not shining as light?